Hello, um, welcome to SKR Academy video tutorial in the name uh, reaction series. Uh, today we will go through uh, Mitsunobu reaction. Mitsunobu reaction uh, was first discovered by o Oyu Mitsunobu in around 1967. This is a, a very good reaction of alcohol. Mainly alcohol uh, react with uh, acid or phenols. Uh, if they react with the acid, they form an ester in presence of triphenylphosphine and DEAD. DEAD is a short form of diethyl azo <coughs> um, dicarboxylate and uh, triphenylphosphine in presence of uh, usually this reaction run in THF, tetrahydrofurane, and 0 degrees Celsius to uh, over longer period at room temperature or sometimes it need uh, heating. The important thing is, uh, in case of alcohol, if it, uh, it has chiral center, then in this reaction, uh, inversion of stoichiometry take place 100%. So let's see its uh, reaction mechanism, how this reaction take place. Here I wrote this uh, reaction mechanism. First step, what happened? Uh, the, this is dead. Um, D, E, A, D. Um, diethyl, di diethyl azo, this nitrogen nitrogen bond is azo and dicarboxylate. In first step, the triphenylphosphine uh, attack, this is a nucleophilic attack on the dead and uh, you can see it donate uh, their electron to this nitrogen and the uh, double bond move to the other nitrogen and it form a betaine intermediate which is kind of a jitter ion it has positive ion and negative ion, both. And this uh, betaine intermediate can also exist in the other form. It can go on either on the left nitrogen or on the right nitrogen. So I represented here once again. Uh, and then in the second step, what happened? Um, this uh, negative ion of the nitrogen absorb a proton from acid this uh, acid group and electron goes to this oxygen makes a uh, ion pair intermediate and you can see this adsorb uh, this <coughs> take one proton from the acid group and it reduced to one uh, it takes one uh, hydrogen and then uh, one carboxylate ion form and the next step, once again, this uh, um, ion pair can adsorb another uh, proton. But before that, uh, alcohol attack this uh, alcohol uh, electrons from the alcohol attack to the triphenylphosphine because of it has positive charge, and then it forms this intermediate, where um, now oxygen get. You can see oxygen get a positive charge and then <coughs> so in the next step <coughs> what happened um, this proton donate its electron to the oxygen or you can uh, see in the reverse direction you can donate like this then and this bond takes a proton this proton from alcohol and it for it reduces to DEHD diethyl hydrazine dicarboxylate and then it produces two more uh, intermediates once again is a phosphine oxide with a alkyl pho phosphine oxide and carboxylate and the, at the end this phosphine now you can see here this is this is the main point where the stereochemistry turned because right now this bond is uh, above the plane and uh, hydrogen is below the plane so this carboxylate cannot attack on the this carbon on the top of from the uh, plane because this big molecule this is uh, oxide and triphenylphosphine is a very big which makes a hindrance so it attacked from the back side and then this electron goes to phosphine and at the end you will see the product is R1 
R2 and then this hydrogen actually comes up back um, up above the plane and then <coughs> this carboxylate ion comes from the back side makes an ester R3 and another bright product form in this reaction is uh, I'm writing here oxygen double bond E pH3 triphenylphosphine oxide so triphenylphosphine oxidizes into this one and then reduces to DHD and the ester form so this is the main product and thank you for watching we will see in the next uh, videos thank you